Hi, everyone. <laughs> okay, let me put this on. Do not disturb. Me too. <laughs> on. Oh, that's funny. <laughs> we weren't even in here. <laughs> oh. <laughs> we got distracted. Okay. All right. Are we all good? And I'm just I'm just checking out. We were in the other room. Yeah, we're good. Okay, good. Yeah, we're. <laughs> Yeah, we, we were keep an eye on the time. We definitely yeah. did not do that. <laughs> we come running in. Ah, oh, it's one o'clock. Oh goodness. <laughs> yeah. We're always doing a million things. Uh, so hey, oh, Catherine. I need to go live on Instagram. <laughs> oh yeah. Go live on Instagram. Oh, there we go. Go live. <laughs> <laughs> if anybody's never seen us before, they're like, what what's with <laughs> these two girls that do nothing but laugh at the very beginning? Because we're we're trying to figure stuff out. So yeah. hey Diane and Becky. But a few people are Lisa Kenny Marie from Instagram is here. Hi, and Julie, yeah, yeah. Last week we um weren't able to see the comments, but on Instagram, but now we can. So, welcome, yeah, welcome everybody. Thanks for joining us over on Instagram. This is a new, uh, a new sort of uh format for us for Instagram. So, you know, we're, we're trying new things and we got our microphone working. Does it sound better this week? Yeah, somebody just said it sounds uh, much louder. Yes, thank you, Linda. We um, we had to do a bunch of troubleshooting. I did a bunch over the weekend. And then, uh, thank goodness, Savannah and I were playing around this morning because StreamYard, which is the streaming um, company that we use to stream out to all these multiple locations, uh, changed their format over the weekend. So we had to quickly download an app and do a bunch of things. And... Yeah, I actually forgot about that. Good thing we did that earlier. <laughs> yeah, so we've been like clicking our heels and doing a couple of cartwheels at the same time today. So there's been a lot going on. So if you have no idea who we are, I'm Kelly with Kelly's Bee Boutique, and this is my daughter-in-law, Savannah. Hi. And she comes and helps join in on all the, the craziness on Wednesdays. So what we usually do is talk a little bit about ourselves, and then we dive right into some beads. And uh, sometimes we have a... Um, a project often we will have projects and what i'm doing now you'll see that i'm starting to um, sort of extrapolate those projects and i'm popping them on the main youtube page so that you <clears throat> excuse me so those will live in there by themselves so you don't have to watch through all the bead stuff you can actually just see the project today unfortunately we won't have one because we've been doing so much we're today we're we're trying to um come up with a million new ideas because uh, you know the world is quiet. Yeah, I actually, <laughs> I actually said today we may we, we may have to lay off. You know, it's really um, it's just, it's sad. Uh, we're th there's no orders, nothing, not not nothing, not a single one. Mm -hmm. It which is un unusual. I know it's spring break and stuff, but we've never seen it like this. And I know that worldwide there's uh, money issues, and so we're doing you know a lot of things to try to figure out how can we present things a, a little bit better to people. How can we make it? Um, yes, how can we make it better and more yeah. affordable? So we have a really good thing that we're starting today, which is so you know, exciting. Yeah. yeah. So Hello, the bead hobby shop. Hi, Steph. My sister's on. Oh, hey, Steph. That's Thanks for nice. joining us. <laughs> yeah, she's got a really fun little page. Um, not little. She's got lots of people. Um, Langley with little. She just hit ten thousand followers. Ten? Wow. Yeah. Oh my god. She's over ten thousand now. That's amazing. Which is not yeah. easy to do on Instagram. I have like a measly three thousand or something, and I've been around forever. So. Yeah. Yeah. Um. Oh, you can't buy groceries right now. I'm sorry, Wendy. Yeah, it's it's insane. I I don't know. Um, this is no slag to my friends who own this particular store, but it's some fr lovely friends of ours own a local store, and um, they're they're um, sort of a niche kind of thing, you know. Anyway, they have beautiful stuff, and um, they do fair pricing and everything. But <laughs> they posted something yesterday. Now again, this is no in case. Amanda's watching. <laughs> There's nothing against them. This is the reality of the world. They had a three pound prime rib roast on mm -hmm. $75. No. Three pounds. Yeah. It's, it's too much right now. Like, Everything's so expensive. I said to Rob, who can afford that? For a three pound roast, that's a one, that's a one meal thing. If you've got a family not even. And, and that's not even including your carrots and potatoes and flour for the gravy and whatever else, Yorkshire yeah. puddings or whatever else you're going to make. So, you know, I know it's kind of crazy out there. I um, went to Walmart yesterday, didn't do a big grocery shop. I think I walked away with three bags and a jug of orange juice and I had to get shampoo for me and shampoo for grace and conditioner. Um, and it was $188. Holy was like, mackerel. I didn't even get fun stuff. Yeah. Well, I think that's the thing <laughs> is people are not able to buy the fun stuff right now. They're yeah, having crazy. to, 
um, put aside their, I feel like my hair is sticky note all over here. So no, if you're yeah, bothered yeah. by me, touch my hair, whatever. <laughs> um, <Deuces>. um, <laughs> I think, you know, like my son makes really good money and he was saying, I can't understand why we can't do what we want when I make this kind of money. And it's the reality for a lot of people right now. Mm -hmm. Right. So, so that's why we're going to start this new um, program today that you may have seen. Now, um, Savannah is going to show you live um, what this whole thing is now. Oh, thank you, Wendy. You know, <laughs> it's my new look. I'm going for a whole new look. I got a new top. I'm wearing jewelry. I have my old wedding rings on, which is making my husband very happy because I don't wear them. So I'm switching them to my right hand. I can't yet because one doesn't fit, but I'm going to wear them on my left hand when I go traveling because I don't want to wear this expensive ring traveling. So, <laughs> so instead I'll wear my wedding. <laughs> I'll wear my <laughs> less than expensive wedding ring. Well, I had him buy me this. It's a very simple um, wide band with um, small diamonds on either side. This is what he proposed to me with because I worked in a jail at the time and he couldn't have big diamonds and you know expensive jewelry because... I was on the floor with having fights with prisoners. So I wasn't going to wear, I mean, you can see this one got really beat up. Um, it needs to be buffed. But um, so I didn't want anything, you know, like super expensive. And then I added a diamond sort of half eternity band here. Um, so, you know, you'll see them underneath the camera at some point. But so if anybody's wondering why I've got lots of bling on, it's because I can wear them now. They actually <laughs> fit since, since how I've, I've lost all this weight. So Vegas, 750 for a dozen of eggs. That's awesome. <laughs> that's, that's that's just great. I don't know what, what are people supposed to do, go in their backyard and dig up dirt for food now? It's nuts. So anyway, we're trying to uh, turn it around a little bit more positive um, uh, here. Yeah, that's what I used to do, Kelly. I worked in a, I worked for the uh, Royal Canadian Mounted Police and I worked in their jail. And um, so I would be booking in the bad guys uh, when they were freshly arrested. So they were usually belligerent and drunk and high and... Smelly. smelly and screaming and swearing and having fights and punching each other out and hitting police officers and hitting it's never me a and, dull moment you know and then when i would get him into a cell there was a whole other host of things that they did in there that were any bodily function things that they could do to try to get back at me for just doing my job Gross. they would do all the things and so i've seen everything i've had you know men call me down to the cell like they're having a panic attack something's going on and I look in there and all they wanted to do me do was show me what they had between their legs I'm like oh yay thank you I appreciate that good for you yeah I'm like good job <laughs> I mean the stuff that I used to have to deal with they would take like hours and, and rip up their socks like by the thread and then they would like braid it and then they would try to hook it around the um the uh, sprinklers to try to commit suicide. <laughs> Some of the stuff that I saw was just like, okay, we're humans here. Let's act yeah. like it, right? So yeah. <laughs> then there's, I mean, I could keep you guys here for like four, five, six hours. Well, we've had some good stories. Yeah, I tell it's the great. girls some of this stuff. I mean, I can say all the lewd things that happen too, but uh, you know, it's crazy. So um, yeah. it was, it was a great job. I miss it. I miss, I actually miss some of the bad guys, which is crazy, but um, you get to know them. I always say it was the same hundred people in and out all the time. Right. So um, yeah, that was, a, that, that was my other life. Well, yeah, that was a long time ago, but for the bead world. Yes. I often say Kristen that I should write a book that, but I don't know if it's going to be a comedy or a tragedy. <laughs> I think it'd be a mix. I think so. I've had a life, man. I've had, I've done, I've done a lot. You've lived a life. I have lived a life. So, and I'm living another life now because with dropping all this weight, um, I'm, I have a newfound freedom of movement and being a lot happier and buying new clothes and feeling good in them and feeling cute again and putting on makeup and curling my hair and wearing my old jewelry and, you know, all those things. So I feel like I'm getting a, a, a second chance to care at almost 65 years old, which is kind of, kind of fun. So yeah anyway all right um okay so back to the beads so because we got to get through all of this mm -hmm. today so if savannah can um share the screen so what we started um as of today we alluded to it well we didn't allude to it we talked about it last week so we have a whole new um page you're gonna have to bring it up because i don't even know what it's called can i go to it now i think so and if we lose you we'll come back oh they can still see our face okay, okay. good Hang so on. so if you go back to the main just go right there too it's loading. Oh, 
Sorry, it may show everyone how to get there. It may not like it. So we're just going to show you where it is. Oh, yeah. So if you go to online shopping and then drop down to bead, build your own bead buffet and you click on that. And then I've written a long story about why I called it the bead buffet. Um, and basically it was because, you know, I used to love it when my parents would take me to the um, buffets because you didn't have to have broccoli. Mom wouldn't tell us that we could or couldn't eat anything when we went to buffets. And so I was kind of like, oh, that sounds like a good idea for beads. We get to have like a, a choice of multiple things. So basically I say, if you're someone who relishes the idea of crafting your own plate, and I put it in quotes, then this is going to be a treat for a unique adventure. Um, so what we're doing is we're taking boxes and boxes of old, of stock that's been like kicking around and not living in anybody's home. And we're putting them in, in bags and bagging things all up. So now I've gone for the, the theme of food because, you know, I like that. Um, so we have our $1 uh, bead appetizer and we'll show you a couple examples of things. So it's just an appetizer. It's like a Why little... don't you show it right now while we're... Oh, wait, no, I can't, never mind. can't do that. So <laughs> yeah. we've got our $1 bead um, appetizer. Now these are going to be all sorts of different things. There'll be beads, there'll be findings, there'll be leather, there'll be tools, all tassels. Kind of, yeah. For $1, you're going to get something maybe a little bit smaller. It's not going to be a big, massive pile of stuff, but it, it'll be a, like something that's worth more than a dollar, but it'll be a dollar. Everything is, is worth more than what it is listed at. Yeah. So if you get something that says a dollar, it could be worth anything from a dollar 20 to 250 to, you know, like there's some things in here where I, I had, I just put an item in and I said, this is a, a $60 item and I put it in at $10. Yeah. So, you know, I'm, I'm just kind of like, I'm kind of going cutthroat on a lot of things. Um, the next one is a $2 and I called that the bead buffet salad. And then the $3 one I called the bead buffet soup just cause I'm being silly. Cause you know me, I like to have some fun. And then four, we're calling that the $4 items are the uh, bead buffet main course. You're going to get a little bit more for your money there in that you're going to get a bigger pile of stuff for $4. And then we've got our bead buffet steak and lobster. And that's where you're going to start seeing some juicy things because we're got, getting more in value. And then we've got my favorite thing, the bead buffet dessert. So that's where you're going to see the good stuff. So anything $6 and above, it's going to be a mystery. You could get a $60 item in there. You could get a $15 item. You could get something that's worth $10 item. $10 item. But six and up is where you're going to, um, you know, sort of see the bigger things. We're, we've got tools. We've got all kinds of things. Mm -hmm. um, so that is how, what you do. You just click on it. So if you want to click on one. Let's go to $1. So you, let's say that you only have a, a, a really, really finite budget and you only have an extra $2 plus, of course, the $7.99 for shipping. You only have two dollars in your in your budget, so you would just put two of them in there. Well, you put one in, <laughs> um, and then you would just check out. So you're going to just have, or maybe you're buying a couple strands of beads, but you only have an extra dollar to add to that. You would just yeah. add one of the bead buffet um, appetizers. Or or if you get fancy, and if you decide, oh, I want to see what she's got in that six dollar thing. I'm going to add like you know six of those or something. So that's all you do is you just add them like a regular um, product. And um, so you can see if you decide if you want to go up. So Savannah has just, you know, raised yeah. that up to. So you got four $6 and a two $2 and you're at 26 bucks. Yeah. So, um, and that does go towards our free shipping, I think, um, in our free shipping thing. So now we will be having to limit the $6 items soon because we only have probably 30, 40 things in there. Mm -hmm. But, you know, because I'm combing the website. So you can go back to our faces, I guess. Okay. Um, um, so hopefully that shows you where it is. But this way we're getting um, not just rid of some things, but we're, we're there's a lot of stuff out there that just is, we can't put it on the website because there's maybe only ones or twos or fours and it's just not worth my time. And there's some things where you're breaking down strands because people don't want a whole strand, but like a, a quarter of a strand. Yeah. Kind of so thing. it's helping, um, mm -hmm. it's helping you guys stretch your bead budget mm -hmm. by having um, lots of, lots of value for what you're, what you're paying. And um, it's helping us get rid of things that are, you know, that we would like to see in your hands versus ours. Does that make sense? So I'm going to get Savannah. I'm first, I'm going to have a little okay. sip. Well, I'm hungry going to the buffet. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Should we uh, show um, an example? Yeah. Example. Do you guys think that's silly that I did the food thing? 
I like it. I just thought it was kind of fun because like to me an appetizer it's kind of like it wets your whistle. Yeah. And then the salad's like, well, we kind of have to have salad cuz mom said we need to have salad. I need to eat some yeah. vegetables. And then you know, you start, you know, I soup. like the, well, I guess I'll have the, some the soup. lobster. My hair is yeah. me. Okay, there. <laughs> All right. Okay, so what you now these are not what you're going to get necessarily. Yes. These are these are some ideas. Oh mm -hmm. good. Um, thank you. I'm glad you guys like it. Um so these are some of the things that you can ex you can expect to see in if you choose them. So this is a one dollar bag. So you'll see it'll come. Most of them will have a price on them. Some of them that don't have a price are one dollar bags because I just kind of tossed a bunch of stuff in there. But this is like a about a quarter of a strand of um, six by eight Chinese crystal rondelles in a beautiful red. Probably doesn't. I don't know yeah. if it comes no, up. it's it's showing. It's not this, too bad. This is really glary. No, no, it, it, they can see. It's hard when we've got the plastic in there. Yeah. So that's only a dollar. So instead of spending um, like four ninety nine, five ninety nine on a whole strand, you're going to get uh, four, eight, twelve, uh, 17. 17 beads for one dollar. So good deal, right? <laughs> Catherine's going straight for the lobster. We don't have butter to go with that, my friend. <laughs> I actually think lobster is disgusting. Oh, I love it. It's It tastes like dirty socks. Oh, well, because they're bottom feeders, right? Yes, it makes sense. All right, this is a really good deal. This is in the $2. So these are, um, we can't even get these any longer, I don't think. These are O-beads. And you might have seen that I've used O-beads a lot in, in those uh, multi-strand leather bracelets. And these are the fire brick red, I believe is the color. And this isn't I, not quite a full tube, but these were about eight or nine dollars. So this is maybe like half a tube or three quarters of a tube, two bucks. Yeah. So a great way of getting a little bit that's enough to do like some things with, a you know, some sort of things in a project, right? So that's a two dollar offering. For three dollars, we have some Tierra cast. We have two of their... Um, uh, chandelier earrings components and I think these components were like almost three dollars a piece so you'll get two for three dollars so we do have some like really good um, quality things in there like tear cast uh, for four dollars this is a big juicy bag of beads that you're going to get um, you've got Chinese crystals and tassels, tassels and... all kind of like blingy um, rhinestone -y kind of things and some uh, captured uh, cage beads and all kinds of things and that's only four dollars and 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 just to reiterate these are not exactly what you're going to get yeah this is just an example of something that is in the bin that says four dollars mm -hmm. you might get you might get something that has like all three of these in there um in a four dollar bag because maybe i made it i make i'm making up bags that have all sorts of like things in them yeah um so on the website gail you will go to online shopping and then it's the first drop down that says um, bead buffet, bead or, something. buffet make, or something. Make, make, make your, your own bead buffet. I think. Yeah. All right. So in the five dollar bin, we've got um, these Eslon cords. So this is four different uh, colors of Eslon in their uh, Tex 210. So there's just we only have one of them. So I was like, well, that's a really good thing to throw in there. And that's mm. in the five dollar bin. And uh, oh, yeah, back in the four dollar bin, we actually have some Kumi, Kumi Himo braiding discs. We used to sell these in the store for $7.99 and we have them in the $4 bin. So if you've never done Kumi Himo, you might get one of these. These are cool and Kumi Himo is super fun. I should actually um, teach it one day, I suppose. Um, but we've got some of those. And then in a $6 bin, we have some of these. I don't know what this um, stone is. I can't remember, but these are a beautiful pendant. And I think these are about like, the value was about $10. And we've got them in the $6 bin. So you'll see that we get, you. there's an array of things. So you can pop us back up. So we hope that, um, we hope that you like that. I think it's a really great way of uh, building your bead stash and maybe having little things that you hadn't thought about and, and you'll get some things that might challenge you, right? Plus like, <clears throat> it's always fun to get a surprise. Yeah. <laughs> Like I would, I, if I was buying something, I'd put a $1 one in just to see what I got. Yeah. You never know. Mystery grab bag. And that, this is going to be an ongoing program. It's not just for today or for just for the next week. We're going to be combing the warehouse for, you know, we've got boxes. I have, we've got a lot of stuff. I found a box, uh, I guess on, must've been Monday that I pulled out. And I know for a fact that the, the beads in there are over 10 years old. I was like, oh, 
I'm pretty sure uh, you should also go through all yes, this stuff. That, yes, the stuff on the bottom of the cart there has to be gone through the, the uh, yeah. I, yeah. Like, <laughs> get rid of that, Kelly. <laughs> I know, I know. Like, so there's there's boxes and bins and it's stuff. Just stuff's kind of everywhere. everywhere. <laughs> and, you know, because there's only a finite amount of time every day, but this is because it's because we're getting like zero orders right now. We've got the time to make a whole pile of things up. So I've just been sitting there just throwing things in bags and like, I'll find a box full of stuff. And so a lot of things I've been taking like a full, if, if we have a full um, thing of uh, seed beads um, and maybe there's like 10 seed beads that gone, I throw it in a bag. And if it was $5, now it's maybe $3. So it's like getting like, you know, 30, 40, 50% off on, I mean, some things are like 70% off. Yeah. It's they're... all, it all just kind of varies, but there will always be a discount. Yeah. You'll get, you'll get your value. And sometimes you might see that you'll order a $1 item and maybe we'll throw in two $1 items. You know, like if I look at it and go, Oh, throw another one in. Yeah. You know, we so... feel like it's not uh, enough. Yeah. So we're going to make sure that they're nice and juicy and it's not a box or anything like that. It's, you know, you just, we're just, it's just stuff. It's like a bunch of really good stuff. We've got tassels, we've got, yeah. and I've I mean, got wire. I we mean, we are combing through and if it's junk, it's, we don't put it in. You know, we just threw out a whole pile of stuff. I went through and I, we, I was like, Oh, that's not very that's good tarnished. quality. Get rid of it. Threw it in the garbage. Cause I said to Savannah, if, if you wouldn't want to get it, then it goes in the garbage. I have really low standards and I yeah. threw that out. <laughs> yeah, because when it's tarnished, I wouldn't want to get that. I wouldn't oh, want to pay for it. if I put my money towards that. If we threw that in as a freebie, that's one thing. Um, but I wouldn't ever make somebody pay for something that's really tarnished like that. So, probably shouldn't um, have thrown those out. The well, bin. <laughs> yeah, we could maybe do that. <laughs> yeah, because yeah, we actually have a freebie bin. So, mm -hmm. you know, we just add little things to people's orders. So anyway, so that's the new thing. So um, have fun with it. I hope that you really like it. It's just, um, you know, it's it, it's a different way of doing the, the mystery bag. And the reason that we started this is because we had a few people reach out and say that they wanted to participate in the Tucson mystery bags that were $25 and $50, but they didn't have that in their budget. Or until and the end of the month. And by then they were sold out. And I feel gone. really bad. Yeah. So we want everybody to be able to participate in the fun things that we do around here. And so now you get to build your own adventure. If you have an extra hundred dollars, you can buy as many things as you want. But if you only have five dollars, you can buy five one dollar things or one five dollar thing or a three it's and a whatever, two. It's whatever you want. Right? Oh, so, Cindy, you have us on the big TV. Can oh, you see my I, pores? Do I look good? Do you see our pores? Because we're so, <laughs> so big in your house. I feel like I'm like... I got weird things hanging all over I'm me. Like a butterfly. Yeah, yeah. Okay, so we have a ton of stuff to here to get through today. So how are we doing for time? Oh, we are. See, we're already at twenty five minutes. Yeah, after. but I don't have to run to get kid. Yeah, she's at grandma and grandpa's for the night, and I don't have anyone home, and I'm very excited. Best night ever. My neighbor ever. and I are going to go to the pool to have a hot tub. Are you? Yeah, and she invited me over for dinner tonight. Nice. Very very nice. Yeah, I was sort of a, a work widow all week. And I don't, I shouldn't say that word because a lot of people are widows and it's not a nice word. I, my husband was not home last week. Let's say that. He was busy. It was a nice break. Yes, he was <laughs> He was doing inventory at his business all, all week and all weekend. And so he wasn't around. So I got to have popcorn for dinner one night and I watched movies and I was kind of lonely, but <laughs> it was kind of nice. The house was spotless or the house still is, but like the house was absolutely spotless. You couldn't clean one more thing. I hung up all of the stuff. So I know you guys have been asking me for a, a home tour from the reno. I finally got up all the things. So I've got the living room and the dining room and the kitchen filmed and I've done the stills, but I need to go back and take a couple more stills because I added some more stuff. So, um, and, and then I will do um, the bathroom and the bedrooms and- the bathroom. Because it's brand new. It's already done. What do you mean it's already done? Oh, I'm sorry. I wasn't really listening to what you Yeah, talking. no, because they want to see that what, we, what we've been doing for the you last... I you saying you still need to decorate because I no, zoned out for... No, it's all decorated. <laughs> I need to film it. So I just filmed the living room, dining room, kitchen because I figured that's going to be enough of a video because I know that not everybody wants to see my house, but a lot of you it's have It's really asked. nice. You want to see it. Yeah. <laughs> it looks really good. Thanks. I think it turned out pretty darn Cam good. Cam really so. likes it. My Does husband, he? Yeah. He's like... She has so little stuff in there, Savannah. You should take a hint. <laughs> I was I cleaned yesterday. I vacuumed the house spotless, and then Cam was like, he got home an hour and a half later, and I was in the kitchen doing something, and I look in the living room, and I was like, he won't even know I've cleaned this little kid. Just ruined the place. I was so mad. 
What's the point of cleaning? <laughs> I, yeah. I, if kids are just going to trash it again. Yeah. Well, like there's doll clothes everywhere and drawings and she, she like tapes them on the wall. And I'm like, can you just go to sleep <laughs> at four o'clock? <laughs> For the day. Yeah, Farron came over and she's like, Mom, your house is just so perfect. How come? I said, I don't have three kids living in my home. That's why. Yeah. Because she they've got two teenagers and a six year old or five year old. Five year old? She's five year old five year old. She's turning six. And um that's why. I only have a husband. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. <laughs> and that's was, bad enough. <laughs> I was it's just it's defeating when that happens. Yeah. Do they have oh nobody's leaving comments over there today? We've had a couple comments yeah. on Instagram. Okay. We're just looking at the Instagram to see who's who's over there and everything. So, all right. So that that's coming up. I'm hope, hoping I'm going to get at that this weekend. I'm, I'm trying. You know, there's just so much going on lately. So, all right. So we still have some Tucson stuff to show you. And we'll still have more next week. I just didn't get to it. We've got, like, the, like, the best stuff. Yeah. Left. We have so much stuff that we couldn't even include it all today. Um, we had to, we had to pick and choose what we could show today. So a lot of this is restock. Some of it is Tucson, and some of it's brand new. So let's get to it, Miss Savannah. Okay. A, somebody said that they like the color of my blouse. Lois, thank you. It's brand new, and I wasn't going to keep it because it's big, but I was like, no, it I like really it. Good. It's cute. Marcy has a husband and two cats, and it's a disaster. I feel oh yeah, Michelle. No, it's Michelle. She's just saying mercy. Oh. Yeah. <laughs> Once again. Yes. <laughs> uh, I had to hand type everything out. So uh, no promises with uh, spelling today. Again. Oh, you didn't do uh, copy and paste? No, because it kept messing up and it was taking too long. Oh, and all right. So I just had to, it, some items work, some don't. Okay. Semi-precious, it does not work. Did you want to put back oh, on? yeah, uh, right. <laughs> yeah, put me down and then uh, maybe go, yeah, put me down, Sam. <laughs> and maybe go back to Instagram. Yeah, I will. see. All right. So now if uh, maybe you can just pop up our website, um, let that run for a second sure. so that anybody that's new, um, I wish it wasn't so, you know what, if you do it as a ticker, it's smaller. If you do, um, if you go back and do it as a versus a banner, if you do it as a ticker, then like if it scrolls, Good see how much idea. smaller it is because Good otherwise one. it takes up so much of the screen Good um so idea. so anybody that's new would um be able to see how to find us mm -hmm. right okay all right so we have some beautiful um four millimeter glittery argentic fire polish beads these are stunning so they're kind of a a really unique sort of um like a like a deep taupe sort of a silvery taupey kind of color. And then they've got the um, the coating on it that like gives it that- Oil slick almost. Yeah, so yeah. That, but they're a really beautiful mm -hmm. color. So this is FFF278 and they're $3. And this is, we don't, is this all we have? Or is there, I don't uh, know. Yeah, I think I We have limited so. and I can't ever get any of these ones again. So if you want any of this kind of stuff today, you'll have to grab them because they will be, they will be gone. Um, but that is FFF278, and they're a four millimeter fire polish, and the color is glittery argentic, and they're three dollars. What do you need a magnifying glass to see? Um, what's that? Oh, the the Kelly's oh. Beach Boutique. Oh, yeah. <laughs> it just to help people that um, don't know how to find us. Yeah, it is really small. <laughs> yeah, I know, <laughs> but but you can't, you know, it just takes up too much of the screen to do the other thing, right? Well, we'll turn it off. In a yeah. All right. So we have FFF280. This is a four millimeter fire polish and the color is crystal gray rainbow for $2. This one is really cool because it's got sort of a smoky gunmetal and a smoky sort of um, like a European gold. And then it's got kind of a it's almost taupey, got purples like to a, it. Well, I think that's a little bit of like the, the coating that they put on, mm -hmm. but it's kind of a like, like a, a muted mauvey, mauvey kind of color. I don't know. Mm -hmm. It's a really beautiful color combination. So this is FFF280, four millimeter crystal gray rainbow fire polish beads. And these are $2. I think that one would be fabulous because it goes with so many things, right? Like, it go with a nice brown. <laughs> yeah, my, with my good brown. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, I just, I like, I really like sort of muted tones. Mm -hmm. I don't know. I feel like they really work with... Um, See that with smoky quartz? Yeah, any of those, you know. I, I love my, my smoky quartz for sure. Okay, next one we have is FFF281. And this is a four millimeter aqua valentinite. 
Woo, that one was hard. Uh, fire polish bead for three dollars. And these are my color combinations together. They're really, it's really pretty. That is so nice. We got this fancy new light. Let's see what happens. Oh yeah. I've got this like. Eh, not much. Not much. <laughs> no. No. Didn't do anything. No. Uh, well, a little bit. A little bit. Yeah, not much. <laughs> We're just seeing if it works, you know, like we have all these things. The light is actually really good today. Yeah. Well, their new app, maybe it's better. I think it is the app. Yeah. Can you guys see the things, the colors yeah. really well? It, like, do they look good? Does it they, look more clear too? Here. Because they, they um, I, I had to actually use an app today instead. So mm. a little different. Got lots of people joining from Instagram. Yeah. yeah. Thanks for joining us Nina on Instagram. Nina and Crisscross Company. Awesome. Bayshore Design Studio. All right. Welcome. Well, welcome everybody. All right, here we have FFF279, and these are a four millimeter light sapphire blue, half amber fire polish bead. That is a lot of words. And these are $3.60. That looks, that's a, a really beautiful color combination with that. It's a really beautiful blue. It's a really unique sort of denim blue. Oh yeah, I was gonna say denim. Yeah, and then mixed with that half amber. So it's not full amber all the way around. So you get half amber and half of the, they say sapphire, but like looks like a denim to me. So that's a really cool way of doing a bead. It's like a half and half. And I'm going to look for stuff like this. I'm heading over to the Czech Republic in uh, two months, uh, two months tomorrow. So um, I will be looking for stuff like this. Everything's Yeah, everyone says clear. the color looks really great today. So okay, that's nice. Maybe it's that new app. I'll have to tell uh, StreamYard they did good. Uh, these ones are fun. Yes. And a little bit of Elsa. I'm like frozen. <laughs> okay, this is FFF283, and they're a three millimeter semi transparent crystal aqua opal with silver fire polish. Who again, a lot of words, but these these are very Elsa ish. They're very um, frozen. Uh, le, uh, like Ice Queen. Ice Queen. You know what I mean? Ice Princess. Yeah, yeah kinda... something like that, or like just snowflakey. Yeah. Christmassy. Winter. They're beautiful. That's Absolutely the word. Beautiful. Winter. <laughs> yeah. Really, really nice. So these are three millimeters, so they're a little bit smaller than the other ones. So that's FFF283. So if you're looking to um, buy these and you've never bought from my website, you just type in that code up in the uh, top search bar and hover for a second. Because if you just type it in, sometimes it'll say, sorry, this doesn't exist. But if you hover, you'll see that it um, sort mm -hmm. of propagates or whatever the word is. All right. Uh, you guys all loved these. So I got more. So when we brought these in at uh, um, the beginning, when we first got back from Tucson, you um, bought all of them. And so I got hold of my supplier and said, please send me more. So this is FFG007, and they're the 3 by 4 millimeter gradient Chinese crystals. Now, I didn't come up with fancy names on all these because I've been busy. Uh, so they called this number 6, and so I called this number 6. So this one has a combination of, it goes from like, purples and pinks to greens and back. So the gradients, like Tessa took, took really nice pictures so you can see how, the, how they work. Um, but there's sort of a, a good example of how it does a gradient kind of pattern. And these are only $3.99. So this one is FFG007 and it's what we call our number six. Okay. We're trying to simplify things so that I'm not spending so much time wasted. And this one is FFG004. This is my personal favorite. This is our number two. And this one has, um, it starts off with yellows and I don't even like yellow, but I think yellow and this is pretty. So we've got yellow to the red, to the fuchsia, to the, um, back to the yellows and back to sort of, it sort of blushes out and then goes back to a darker red and then back to the fuchsia. So look how pretty that is. That's FFG004, and again, they're only $3.99. Isn't that pretty? Mm-hmm. Love that one. Very pretty. So I hope we're not going too fast. I just want to get through. Got a lot, a lot left to show still. Yeah. <laughs> um, grab that one. Is that one there? Okay. To... Okay. This one is FFG008, and they're a 3 by 4 millimeter gradient Chinese crystal strand, and this is our number 9. So this one starts off at a really soft yellow and goes to this really light, soft blue, and then goes to a super soft pink, and then back to the yellow and the blue and the pink. So this is, I don't know if it'll show up very well on the um, mat. It's so soft. I yeah, love that one. It's a really, really beautiful, soft palette. 
And these are just a three by four millimeter. So they're three millimeter up and down and four millimeter wide. So they're kind of like that nice, perfect size for little projects. These next ones are really fun. Yeah, they are. They remind fun. me of a snow cone, actually. Oh, really? Yeah. Hmm. I don't know. Yeah, yeah, they kind of do. They look like a snow cone. <laughs> yeah, they kind of do. FFG005, and this is the number four. So we've got yellow and uh, very hot pink and blues and purples. And it almost goes down to like a green kind of like tone. Like a seafoam mode? Yeah. Almost. Like that. That's kind of cool. So that's FFG005. So look at that. Yeah. They look so cool in the gradient. I think they're just a really unique kind of thing. And you guys really seem to like them. So we thought, well, let's get some more. <coughs> Pardon me. I had another shipment coming in, but it got lost. So I had to get oh. hold of China last night and say, hello, <laughs> my shipment's been lost. So frustrating when I need something because I need something in that box. And now I'm going to have to wait because it's going to have to come all the way from China. So what apps? Things happen. FFG006, and this is another gradient one. So they're all a little bit different. So this one goes like sort of the um, bright fuchsia to purple to green and back to um, pink and fuchsia and purple and green. So very unique kind of color combinations. And they're just kind of fun, and they're only $3.99. So mm -hmm. this one's FFG006. All right, I need a quick drink of my drink. Okay. Well, I'm just, uh, we have some more new followers on Instagram. Hello, everyone. Thank you for uh, joining in. If you haven't ever, um, if you if you don't follow us, please do. And if you are yeah. uh, YouTuber kind of people, head on over to YouTube. I do tutorials over there. Wednesdays are more about showing beads. And over on um, YouTube, I do uh, tutorials on how to, you know, create things. I use a lot of leather and barrel knots. I'm sometimes known as the barrel knot queen. <laughs> That's why I have that up there on my um, thing. So um, yeah, head on over, make sure you subscribe and, and uh, follow us on um, all the channels that you can. It really does help us out. So this is FFG001 and they're a six millimeter faceted Labradorite strand. And these are $18.99 and these are stunning. They have a lot of flash. And I wonder if my fancy new little camera here or light, whoops, sorry about the noise. If that will, oh yeah. Yeah, it shows the makes, flash. Makes really it really well. kind of glisten. Look at that. So we've had some requests for um, more faceted beads. So these are brand new. We haven't carried these before. Really? You've had more requests? Yeah. That's yeah. awesome. Because yeah. we last year it wasn't uh, yeah. it wasn't as popular. But yeah. so, everything in Tucson was faceted. Yeah. So these are beautiful quality too. They, um, Look at that one. Yeah. They're really cool. So this is FFG001. And that's for a full strand of six millimeter faceted. Yeah, look at all the, the flash on there. Really pretty. Uh, you will notice that beads have gone up in price. I've done my very, very best. I always do trying to keep the prices down, but who Lord, some of them were just crazy. So if, um, if any of our strands are over $20, they go into our bougie beads page where we have our higher priced um, beads because some people want those. Um, but I do try to keep them under 20 when possible. So this is BBB664 and they're a four millimeter faceted Labradorite strand and these are beautiful. That one has so much flash in yeah, it. Yeah, this one really does. <clears throat> Bring up my little thing here. Let's see if that, does that? Oh yeah. Oh yeah. It does kind of, it does kind of make it a little bit brighter. I don't know. I can't see when I'm doing two things at once, but. No, it definitely yeah. lets you. Uh... Yeah, super, super pretty. So these are just a little four millimeter, um, just a lovely little bead for $12.99. All right, so that one's BBB664. Now we used to carry these, uh, but I got them from a different supplier and I like her color much better. Um, this is ABB736, so if you had had these before, they would have had a lot more brown in them, but this company um, does a lot of blue. So these are, a, these are dyed and they are an eight millimeter faceted blue agate bead for $7.99. Super nice. Love those. We actually just had a, a girl in who has this huge, um, huge business, and she bought a bunch of these, and she's happy because they're a lot more blue because that's what she uses in one of her project, one of her um, pieces that she sells multiples of. So she just bought a bunch of those. And another one of the new faceted is FFG003. That's not faceted. Yes, it is. Oh, that's yeah. faceted. <laughs> so this is a six millimeter faceted rhodonite with matrix. 
So Tessa loved this one. She loved that. I had two different choices of the rhodonite, whether I had it with the matrix or not. Like you can get rhodonite that looks just like this and they call that um, Chinese rhodonite. But if you have the matrix, which is all the like sort of the black on it, um, then it's called rhodonite with matrix. So this is $13.99. And the faceting always adds to the price because somebody has to sit there and facet all those. That's insane. I know that I, I call that a short straw. Whoops. Oh, sorry, Mike. I hit Mike. Um, what do you like imagine? I call that a short straw job. How their um, eyesight is. Yeah, well, mine's, I think mine got wrecked from doing so much, you know, um, beading and stuff over the years. I mm -hmm. don't know. I think it's really hard on it. This is my personal favorite. Look at this. FFG000. This is a six millimeter faceted carnelian. Now, we are very limited on these, um, the, the faceted ones because I wanted to see whether or not people like them. I can always get more, but I wanted to sort of uh, see. So I think I'm, this is, that's that's it, right? Just 10? That's it, yeah. Yeah, we only got 10 strands of each of the faceted, except the four millimeter ones, because we know that you guys love those. But um, so if these sell out right away, I will reorder. And I'm, next time I order, um, I am going to buy multiple colors of different things. I was just sort of, I had to do a quick order for that other customer. Um, and that's a really good point to bring up right now. If you have a bigger bead business and um, you want to buy your beads um, in, in bulk, in that you're buying 20 strands of one color, get hold of me and I um, give really good wholesale pricing to anybody that is looking for that. But you can't buy one strand of something. You yeah. have to buy, because I have to order these in um, you know, 10, 15, 20, 30 from China. So if you um, are somebody that needs good pricing, I can always give that to you. Um, so some people don't know that they can do that. All right, we have FFG002, and these are an eight by six millimeter faceted Misty Rose Chinese Crystal for $2.99. And it's a really pretty color. It's kind of like a, it's like an opaque cream, but it's got just a hint of a rosy pink on there. Oh, I love it. Like it's just the yeah. perfect, even Lori yesterday, she said, oh my gosh, as she was processing them. She's like, this is a really it's, pretty color. It's just like delicate. It is. You know what I mean? Yeah, but it's, it's not gentle. Too, it's not too precious. That's no, why I like it. no. And we do have, to, I think we have 20 strands of this one. Yeah, so. there was more of that one. This is FFG002. So I had two boxes come from China. Well, three boxes come from China. Um, this was in one box by itself. And the other part of that order is the one that got that's lost. They put one item in the box? Yes. Oh, that's fancy. <laughs> and then the other box went missing. <laughs> and then trying to communicate that to them, they just didn't understand what lost meant. I'm like, well, the shipment didn't show up. Like a UPS reached out and said, whoops, we can't find your package. <laughs> so are they going to like, do they pay you back? Uh, like... They're going to resend it. They're, oh. they're, uh, the company in China is going to resend and they'll have to deal with UPS on insurance. Right. Okay. Yeah. So I got lucky there. Mm -hmm. So this isn't that. What are we at? We are at the um, bumble, oh, this, yeah, this one. Sorry. All right. So <laughs> back in the store, when we had our brick and mortar store, we used to carry these. And um, one of my suppliers had them again. And I thought, well, I'm going to try them again because um, I know you guys really liked them before. Uh, this does not look very good on my hand. No. I can't see with my... Um, let's see what have we got here. You can put it in this. Yeah, I'm going to put them on this Sorry, little box. So these are a 22 by 17 millimeter honey opal uh, check glass. And it's got a bronze wash over it. And this is a little, um, it's a bumblebee. So these are a great little pendant. They're $2 a piece. And it's FFF282. Do you want to get so, your little light and shine it on? Yeah, There's a little bit of a out. shadow on it. Yeah, it's really shadowy. Mm -hmm. That's a bit better if we go up yeah. a little higher. The beads. There, yeah. can you see? Yeah. I mean, they really have good detail on them, and they're so sweet. If you love, um, whoops, well, we got one left. One bee, uh, bee flew away. Um, if you love the bumblebee kind of thing, these are so, so sweet. All right, so that's FFF282. Yeah, I got to figure out how to show things like that. Remember we used to use that little tray thing, the little stool back oh. here? And the hat box sometimes. Yeah. Yeah, we got to dig those out, I guess. All right, these. <laughs> okay. When I saw these in Tucson, I I think, didn't I buy all of them? I think I just grabbed yes. everything you on her. You took every single thing on the wall. Every single one. Because this, when you want to know what makes Kelly super excited in Bead World, this. <laughs> this is what makes Kelly excited. This is check glass that made me squeal. 
This is FFF286, and there is 17 by 18 millimeter. So, um, yeah, 17 by 18 millimeter uh, elongated heart. And this one is a blush pink with a travertine finish over top of it. Flip it over for one of them over because the backs are different. Yeah, so they are, yeah, they've got, see how they go. That's, oh, I didn't even notice that. Yeah, one side's a little bit orangey. Yeah, so I that's really the, like it. That's the uh, the cool finish. So that's why this one here has done that. Oh, okay, I see. Mm -hmm. I didn't even know that. I just saw this side and went, oh my gosh, I love that. So these are $9.99. They're beautifully made Czech glass. If I um, sell out of these and when I head over to the Czech Republic, I am going to look for more because these are absolutely stunning. So this color is FFF. Two eight six. I think people hated us when we went to the Czech glass booth because we took it all. Um, like not like the you know you have the people who grab like one or two strands and then Kelly was like sorry everyone and just takes the whole. <laughs> I'm the grabbing whole like tray. all of them. Yeah. <laughs> so this is FFF two eight four and this is, again is a seventeen by eighteen elongated heart, and this is a matte yellow with white with a travertine finish. So you'll see how one side, yeah, that's a good thing to point out, that one side mm -hmm. looks this way and then the other side will look that way. But I think that makes it really, really unique. And you know, I always, I always say, I don't love yellow, but this is pretty because it's a nice sort of rich goldy yellow. Mm -hmm. I love that. Catherine's squealing. I oh, know. Oh, goodness gracious. <laughs> <laughs> right, Wendy, I do. When I see something I love, I grab all of it. You know, because I don't want you guys to say, oh, she only got four strands of that. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Um, Valerie, if you type it in the code on the website, you just want to let it um, hover for a little bit and then it should come up because it did come up for me earlier. The four millimeter labor lab labradorite. Yeah, if you just, I don't know, can we show them how that works? Uh, yes. uh, can you screen share again? We're just going to do a little show and tell for a sec. Hi, Barbara. Mm -hmm. um, um, okay. And are you worried? No, nope, we're good. Okay. So if you type in, what is the, um, the Labradorite, um, what is that code? Um, <laughs> uh, Try FFG00. Oh no, the four millimeter. Just trying to see which one is the, oh, it's probably one of these ones in here. That's the six. Okay. BBB664. BBB664. So you're going to let it sit and then it pops up at the drop down right here. But you have to actually click on that. If you click on the, um. Uh, if you just click on the little uh, eyeglass thing there, it doesn't really work. Yeah. Uh, BBB. Six, six, four. Yeah, so if you just did this here, it typically doesn't, it won't work. Yeah, I don't know why. It's just yeah. a quirky little thing. So, um, oh, Wendy, I hope you feel better. All right. Um, so I just want to show you guys that. So if you're looking for something, you can, um, uh, that's how you can search, use our search bar. Okay, Catherine squealed over those. I'm squealing over these. These say Kelly, right? Yes. These are me. I love this color combination together. This is a FFF285, and I, I have quite a few of these because I love them. Uh, this is the matte tea with travertine finish. Oh my gosh, these are just stunning. Do you guys like this? I mean, I just think they kind of have like an old world look to them. Just, I think, look at that as an earring, just having that, or even just something hanging from like a, mm -hmm. a ring on a necklace or something. I don't know. I just think they're fabulous. They're not even too big that they wouldn't work for like a charm on a, on a bracelet. Like, see, it's not, not I'm much. I'm worried they would break though. Well, it's glass. I mean, if you're tough on things and you yes. slam slamming your, you know, wrist around, yes, it might. Because they are glass. All right. So here's a bunch of restocks that we have. Um, we've been out of stock on a lot of this stuff forever, so we thought we would show you. And we also have tons of restocks that we're not showing today. Yes. Yeah, so, so if your favorite bead has been out, check the website because we have a lot of stuff back in stock. Mm -hmm. So this is FFF012. We just sold out of these, uh, like I, we got them in from Tucson and they were gone right away. Like within a day. Yeah. So these are the FFF012, a four millimeter carnelian and they're $4.99 a strand. So beautiful quality carnelian, and this pairs so nicely with smoky quartz. I love that combination of if you're doing like sort of a, a more earthy autumn tone kind of um, jewelry, and then add in a little bit of um, green aventurine, and that is the most beautiful color palette, uh, mixing those three colors together. So FFF012 for $4.99. 
And then we did get some Moonstone back in, although I practically had to sell my firstborn, which would be Savannah's husband. Uh, the, Don't do that. <laughs> Moonstone is really crazy. This is ABB 966, and this is a four millimeter uh, white AB Moonstone. So it does have that beautiful flash on there. And these are $16.99 a strand. So we will notice that price has gone up. I did the very best I could on trying to keep those down, but holy smokes, they're just getting up there. But you know, they're Moonstones, so that's what happens. Okay, now I did order um, pink Morganite from my vendor. Uh, and she did not send me pink morganite, but she did send me uh, the multi morganite. So this is BBB 666, and this is the four millimeter faceted morganite for $12.49. So it has all the beautiful colors, the pinks and the blues and the ambery golds and yellows and greens. That's and such a good price. $12.49? Yeah. Yeah? I yeah. love... Morganite's I, expensive. Yeah, it was always on my, like, uh, when I win the lottery, I'll buy it. Oh. But at that price... <laughs> Yeah, don't maybe I won the lottery. Maybe you won the lottery. No, I'm joking. I'm still broke. <laughs> All right, and then a good basic ABB 759, four millimeter black onyx, and they're $5.49. So just, you know, good staple sort of thing to have in your uh, bead stash. And we've been out of stock on a lot of these for a long time. Mm -hmm. So. All right. The next one we have is ABB, oh sorry, I scratched okay. it. ABB 933, and these are a six millimeter lapis lazuli strand for $9.99. And this is a really beautiful quality. I like lapis because it looks, it must live next door to um, pyrite or something because it looks like it has pyrite mixed in it almost. So pretty. It's got that real vibrant um, sort of denim blue color to it. Mm -hmm. They're $9.99. So ABB 933 for six millimeter lapis. Um, Gail, you can just go to the beads and then semi-precious and then click on that and every single bead will come up and you can just go to the name of the type of bead and then it should come up. I'm not sure why it wouldn't work on an iPad. Yeah. I don't know how. Or... Yeah. It's so it's, it's the way that your search is working on the iPad. Mm -hmm. So, um, if you type in, um, is the search bar not, because it, it's working on, if you do it on ours, right? Because mm -hmm. Savannah was able to find it and she's on a Mac. It could be because they don't have a mouse or a trackpad. Yeah, it that could be, be it. Good. So you might have to just sort of, um, if you want, if, instead of typing in AAA162, you might have to go to um, Carnelian beads and then look for the six millimeter Carnelian strands. You might have to go the long way. You know, that's kind of the... Mm -hmm. kind of a drag but um oh i remember one bead that i oh you did bring it okay good <laughs> sorry i'm like i know I, there was something else i wanted to show them so here's our six millimeter carnelian aaa 162 and these are five dollars and 99 cents so if you just type in or don't type in actually go to um online shopping and then go to beads and then go down to semi-precious and then go into carnelian you can yeah. find them that way so it's a little bit of a longer route it'll get you there but it'll get you there because I don't know why it wouldn't um, um, come up on an iPad. I'm not really sure. Okay. Another perennial favorite is um, this ABC 320. This is a 6 millimeter faceted cherry quartz strand for $9.99. This, this basically is our yard right now. <laughs> <laughs> cherry, cherry blossoms. Oh, I love it so much. Yeah, so pretty. Look at that color. It's such a, it's a, a beautiful muted pink. It's a real mm -hmm. soft, dusty rose and kind of mauve kind of tone. I love it. Yeah, in Canada, we say mauve. I know in the United mauve. States, you say mauve, but here we say mauve. So. Our street is lined with cherry blossom trees. So is it's, it? It's beautiful. Oh, right nice. Now. Yeah, we have a, um, a hybrid and it's got two colors. So it's got pink on one side and white on the other. Our cherry tree, it's so nice. All right, this one you guys um, bought out last time in literally a day. Um, okay, Gail, I don't know what to how I can help you. I'm sorry. Um, You're just gonna have to search the name of it. Is it in? Is it in? Um, what's new? I'm just trying to think of another way we can get her there. Let's see. Um, sorry, we're trying to help you. Um, what's new? Um, Semi precious and wood. I don't know. Which is the code for, or what is, what are they trying to I do? don't remember. Oh, BBB664. 
So you have to, yeah, yeah, you have to let it drop down, but I don't know because well, um, they don't have it. So if you went to just go to Labradorite strands, if you go to beads and then semi-precious beads and then Labradorite beads, you'll see it there. Okay. All right. So here we have BBB 658 and they're the four millimeter faceted carnelian strands for $9.99. Like I said, last time I brought these in, they were gone by the next day, I do believe. Yeah, they were gone right away. These are absolutely beautiful. Super, super pretty and really nice quality. They might be like more like a three to me. You know, sometimes, I don't know, sometimes when I get them, I think they look a little, you know, sometimes a little bigger and smaller. But I did explain a few weeks back on how they um, create things now. They're given a rough that's four millimeters in, in a square and then they're told to make a four millimeter round out of it. But you can't so they end up being more like a three so all the beads coming out of china now are kind of and all beads come out of china by the way um they're they're scrimping like everything else it's you know like the shrinkflation thing so that's kind of what's happening with beads uh the heartbeat is by the strand those those beautiful ones that i was squealing over that is by the strand so you get i think six beads for the 9.99 all right what's up <clears throat> i actually don't think it's coming up which one the one that Gail's trying to find. I'm just going to figure it out while you do this. Sorry. Okay. Um, sorry, Savannah's going to be doing something else. Hopefully it doesn't distract me. <laughs> I don't know what she's doing. All right, so we have ABC 319, and it's an 8 millimeter faceted cherry quartz. And these are only $12.99. These are heavy. Super heavy beads. Beautiful quality, though. So you might have to um, go... That's a good question. I just, told, I just answered her. Okay. <laughs> um... So that's the one she's looking for, right? Yeah, but when I when you search just that, it doesn't. Uh, I don't know if it's coming up. I no, I but I, I mentioned she had to go through the long way. So yeah, but it should be coming up here, but it's not. It's not. So you have to go the long way. You have to go online shopping beads, and then go down to um, semi precious beads, and then scroll over to Labradorite beads. Okay. It's the long way, but on a, on an iPad you might have to go the long way. Uh, go to Labradorite, unless they've been put under the wrong section, which oh, right is, there. they're right there. So okay. you just have to go the long way around, um, Gail, that, and you can you can find things. Okay. Um, and quickly, Jennifer, the prices are in Canadian. If you live in the States, you will get an additional uh, between 30 and 35% off, and that is something that your bank will adjust for you. Oh, I just noticed how dirty my glasses are. Maybe that's why I can't see anything. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Another thing that you guys bought out in uh, record time was the FFF015, the six by three millimeter turquoise magnesite Heishi bead for $6.99. These are a really great bead um, just for spacers or putting in wrap bracelets. And this is a really good turquoise color. So these are FFF015. And all of the strands that we have of um, Semi Precious are all about 15 to 16 inches. So you can see you get a lot of beads for that okay yeah jennifer it's a it's a really good deal for my um american people that's for sure and we um only charge 7.99 to us for shipping because it's cheaper for me to send to the united states than it is in my own country which is Same. ridiculous um yeah so we have some good deals all right abb 419 uh we only bought a few i think i bought 10 strands, and that's it, of 8 millimeter white moonstone strands. And these are $33.99. They are beautiful quality. You will find these on our Bougie Beads page because when they are over $20, they always go over into the Bougie Beads. So if you're trying to find these, that's where you can go. It's just right over to Bougie Beads, and they will be right there. So, oh, thanks, Jennifer. I appreciate that. We do try, I try my best to bring in good quality. Um, if I'm not happy with something, I let my, um, my people know, and then, um, they might give me a discount and then I pass that discount on to you and tell you why they're maybe lesser in price or something. So, all right. Another one that we've been out of for a very long time, but is always a super popular one, especially coming into this season, uh, AAA 409, eight millimeter matte white howlite strands. And these are only $7.99. A good deal. You got it to work. Yay. All right. I'm glad. We never know why people's um, things aren't working, you know, like. Sometimes it's your end. Sometimes it's our end. Yeah. Sometimes it's the, we, 
we do like to hear if something's not working. So that means that we can check it because yeah. sometimes um, the it boss happens. is doing too many things at one time. And um, I, I don't always, you know, manage to get it, all my ducks in a row. Yeah. Another one that we've been out of for a while is 8mm Black Onyx. This is AAA184 and they're $7.49. So just a really beautiful quality of Black Onyx beads. Another um, good one to mix with all sorts of different things for your all your jewelry making. Okay. Okay. And Mike got, is right in the way. Yeah, today. The, yeah. Sorry, Mike's right in the way here. Um, I wonder if we put him up there. Oh, I'll just you know what? We'll just forget it. Yeah. So we got <laughs> um, this is BBB 047 and they're a six millimeter cherry blossom jasper for four ninety nine, which is a really good price. But I got these in six millimeter and eight millimeter and I got them in six and eight in a matte too. I just didn't, um, we don't have time to show all of those beads today. So if you like the cherry blossom jasper, the other one was um, like cherry quartz, but this is cherry blossom jasper, uh, $4.99 for a strand. Super, super reasonably priced. I like that one. Yeah, they're a really nice one. So if you like any of them, we have them all listed again and you would find those all under jaspers. I just got an urge to, to bead tonight. Oh, really? Yeah, and I never get that. I always want to crochet. You so. need to make a mala again. You, I you're really good at do. making malas. I, I do like that. Oh, I forgot. I finished my crochet blanket. I was going to show it. Oh, you got to bring it in. All right. We have, uh, yeah. This one? No, the last one. Oh, yeah. So we have not had these for a very long time. ABC 353 8mm Unikite for $6.99. Unikite is such a unique bead. It, it kind of reminds me a bit of um, BC Jade, and then it's mixed, it's kind of got that, that um, mixed kind of coral in there. Really unique color combination, but I love it. And again, this is another one that I would mix myself with uh, Smoky Quartz. I think it would look fabulous. Mm -hmm. And the price is right on them, $6.99, ABC 353. These are Anita's favorite. Really? Yeah. Oh, there you go. And another one that we've been out of, this is probably one of our most popular beads and we've been out forever and everybody's sending me emails. When are you getting them back in stock? They're back in stock and I got lots. <laughs> chill people. Yeah, chill people. <laughs> <laughs> ABB 692, eight millimeter rose quartz and they're $6.99 a strand. Look at that. Super pretty. Just a good, good basic. Mm. All right. Last then, one. The last one that we have, uh, this is always one of our more popular strands. Uh, the price unfortunately went up like crazy, but you guys have heard me talk about um, freshwater pearls and the ridiculous pricing, but these make them even more special because they're uh, 10 millimeter, which is large. These are like a really good grade A quality and they are large hole. So you can always tell the large hole because they have the um, long or the, the heavier uh, thing through the bottom. And these have a pretty good hole. I asked her to, make sure that they drilled them um, two millimeter. So now I can't guarantee that you can get a two millimeter leather through each one, but that you'll at least be able to get a 1.5 millimeter leather. So these are ABD006 and these are $32.99 for a full strand of these beautiful large 10 millimeter, um, so there's kind of like a creamy white mm -hmm. uh, freshwater pearl. And these are beautiful quality. This is one of the nicest um, batches that they've ever sent me. I showed them the, to the girls yesterday. I said, gosh, these ones are really beautiful quality. So and you'll see me using this one in a lot of my demos. I use this all the time because um, I love the size of them and I love the versatility of being able to use that in most of my leather projects. So that's a Hang on. Are we here? Yeah, now Still? you can show it. Oh, okay. That's weird. <laughs> Was that off altogether? Uh, there we go. Okay. Um, I was just wondering, is there a time frame on pay? I would like to get somebody. Well, you can buy them at any time, Sabrina. So they're always, they always live on our website. So you just go onto the website and uh, just place an order whenever you have the money. All right. Yeah. So you can and put our faces we, back. Um, if we are out you can always put a reminder to let you know when they're back in stock. Oh, do you want to show them where that is? This is actually a sure. good, because we're doing um, a little bit of a show and tell today. So let's say that this one, okay, that one's not out of stock. So um, what is out of stock right now? Go over to the bougie. Oh no, I hid those. Um, is there anything in Larimar? Uh, 
No, they're all gone. <laughs> I'm trying to think of something that's out of stock. Um, no, I know those are in stock. Lids. Oh, I'm trying to think of. Oh, the screen was frozen for a sec. Yeah, sorry. Yeah, it went all. Um, I can't think of anything that's out of stock. Or. Mm. Mm -hmm. Will it say, or do I need to click on it? You have to. It actually has to be out of stock for that to come up. But I can't I think of anything that's out of stock right now. Um, goodness. What? <laughs> I don't know. Anyway, it, when you click on it, um, so just click on the Muscovite, and then s scroll down. So right where it shows ABB nine three zero, right okay. there, it'll say um, something like. Uh, please let me know when this is back in stock. And so you just put your email address and it will send you an email when it's back in stock. Um, okay, so if ever there's something that you want and maybe you didn't have the money at the time, um, and when I restock it, you will get um, you'll get a notice. So you can try to figure out <laughs> which ones are out. I guess none of those, because I think I've been hiding anything yeah, that has been out so that people aren't getting frustrated. Um, well, now I'm getting frustrated again. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> there. Just got to put me back. So, so, yeah, there we go. Okay. Um, am I getting more Laramar? I'm hoping so. But, you know, there's a little bit of a, a problem when I buy things from China. I don't always trust the vendors in China. So I'm going to try and buy some from my... I mean, not that the, this is a good vendor. Don't get me wrong. But sometimes, you know... Sometimes things also get lost in translation. Yeah, and it's frustrating. And I know that there's really good dupes in China for Laramar, and I don't want to get a dupe. I want to make sure that I'm getting actual Laramar. So I'm going to do my best to bring um, that back in. And um, yeah, we'll see. I must be sitting down really low because I look really short. There, now I'm the same height as you. I'm so I sit like this. Not yeah. probably. So now the mic is working. It's much better, um, yeah. much better this time, right? So hopefully. Yeah. All right. Well, uh, so don't forget, um, uh, we have our new, uh, I can't even remember what I called it, our bead buffet. <laughs> yes. <laughs> Make your own bead buffet. So if you hop on over to the website and you go down to um, online shopping, the very first thing you'll see is our Make Your Own Bead Buffet. And you can go in and choose your very own um, menu items. Uh, so we have all kinds of things that um, we're, you know, We've marked them down and we're doing like little bags full of, you know, goodies and you get to choose your own adventure. So if you want to spend $20, you can spend $20. If you want to spend $2, you can spend $2. Yeah. If you want to spend $80, you can spend $80. It's up to you. It's up to you and your budget and whatever you're feeling brave with. If you're one of those people that always places orders and you want to just throw a couple in each time just to see what you might get. Yeah, I can't, fun. I can't mm -hmm. guarantee that there are going to be something that makes you go, wah, every time. Um, there's just lots of stuff. Like in uh, in the $5 bags, there's like half strands of 8 millimeter peach moonstone. Mm -hmm. I know that. Yeah, I was telling Kelly that I might cherry pick through things, but I know that's not allowed. But... <laughs> yeah, so. What's she going to do? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> so there's lots of things coming up. Um, Savannah and I were... Um, we're kind of brainstorming an idea right now, and I don't feel like we should talk about it just yet. Not yet, because we have to figure it out. But we're, we, um, would you guys like, let's just maybe ask them. Yeah. If we were to go on a different platform than this, than on, um, than on Facebook, I guess we could do it on Facebook too. Mm. We can only do one or the other. No, because we can use StreamYard. We can just use StreamYard. And we could go on this one and on Instagram at the same time. Just not YouTube. Not YouTube. Why yeah. not? Well, I guess we could go on YouTube. Could go on okay. Let's just float it by. And, I, and we'll give two seconds to see. Uh, we'll get everybody just to say, yes, that's a really great idea. Or, Leave, or take no, a hike. take a hike. Yeah. <laughs> We're thinking of doing some live sales where we actually say, okay, we have three strands of XYZ. The normal price is $9.99. Today, you get this like special code or however we're going to do it. And they're going to be like maybe 20% off or whatever we're going to do. We haven't figured yeah. it out. Um, we want to um, just do some live sales. So you would kind of have to, um, we're, they'll be on our website. So you'd have to quickly hop over to the website. I don't know how, see, that's what we got to figure mm -hmm. out the fine details. See, the problem is when some people do the live sale things, you have to pay a company a lot of money. Mm -hmm. And so it's not really worth it. Um, so we're trying to figure out a way to do it where maybe if you're on the live, you get um, what uh, is, like the Hunger Games. Donna's yes. saying Zed. What's, what is Zed? What, can you elaborate, Donna? Maybe they meant, yes, maybe. 
I don't know. Uh, so anyways, we would give maybe a coupon code and say this coupon will be valid for the next uh, three hours. And then, uh, but when they're gone, they're gone. And we may not be bringing those items back or maybe we will. We're just trying to get, um, get. Uh, oh, X, Y, Z. <laughs> we're just trying to, X, Y, Z. yeah. Yes. Oh, okay, I got gotcha. you. <laughs> anyways. <laughs> so, um, yeah, we feel like that might be something fun to do. And then it's just a coupon code for uh, people watching. And it's not going to be sent out an email. It's not going to be a wide use coupon. It's just for the people who log on at that time. Yeah, so I, I they're mentioning a bunch of people that do them, like Vintage and um, Dakota Stones and Beauty and the Bee do them. So I might hop onto some of their sites because I know all of them personally. I might actually hop on and see how they're doing them mm -hmm. to see. I just don't want to pay a company because then we can't, um, we can't give better prices if I, cause I'm going to, I'm going to have to pay like so much money to these companies in American dollars. Cause you got to remember all of those companies that are doing those live sales are American. So they deal in American dollars. I have to pay 40% more for everything that you see here because mm -hmm. us dollar and the Canadian dollar are so widely apart right now. It's terrible. Yeah. So I don't want to give away more of my money because then, you know, it, I can't give you guys better pricing. Yeah. So I'm going to see what works. Um, Valerie actually had a really good idea. She said, Valerie show say? everything in a live. And then at the end of the sale, things go live. The The listing will go live. Oh, so you can't grab them during the yeah. live. So then maybe so like, people more can plan? write down the code. And so then they know like, oh, okay, I'm going to try and get one of that and two of that and whatnot. And then. Um, they, or you could fill your shopping cart up and then press. No, because we'd have to hide everything. We'd have to hide everything. Yeah. yeah. Well, we'll have to look at it and see what we, we may have to try a couple different things. Um, yeah, Kay does it too. I know a lot of people are doing it. A lot of people are using this comment sold, but that's the one that costs so far much too much money. money. Yeah. And it's another thing that um, I don't want to have to learn because my brain can't wrap itself around one more bit. My hard drive's full. Mm -hmm. And so I don't want to learn anything new. Um, doing the individual invoices it creates uh, just too we wouldn't much work. Even, so much work we wouldn't be able to give a great code like no. discount on it I um, used to do that in my old store in my store we, we started off doing live sales and I <laughs> I wanted to cry I, I I would have my head on the table crying because one trying to get money out of people was horrifying oh I really didn't want yeah. that and then so then you'd have stuff left over and somebody else had said oh I want that but then I'm trying to remember who that was and yeah, so that didn't work Sharon so, says the bead shop does it. She waits till the end of, I'm assuming she was going to say the live. Wait until the end of the live? Yeah, um, at the very top. Okay, I'm going to have to watch a few different people then and see how, again, because we're Canadian, it's a little bit different, but I know there's some Canadian sellers on Instagram, so I might see what they do. Mm -hmm. um, is, has anybody commented over on Instagram to say that they... Um, I have not. Um, yeah, pop-up sales. Um, pop-up sale, yeah. Um, yeah, so I'm, I'm thinking that that's something that we're going to do um, in the future. So uh, we want to be, I think that the, the best way for us is to be, is to connect with you live. I think you guys all enjoy it when we're live and we mm -hmm. can communicate with you. So we want to do more of that. Uh, we want to have the website so that you've always got a place to buy from, but we're going to try and do um, some more lives and we want to try and have some more sales and make it a little bit more fun. Yeah. So that was the whole reason between doing, uh, by doing the, um, Sorry, get my mouth to work. The buffet. For doing the bead buffet. I wanted to have some fun, and that's why I named them all silly names and was just having fun with it. I want this to be an enjoyable thing for everybody. So, um, yeah, so that's what we're going to... We're going to be working on that over the coming weeks, trying to figure out how best um, to do it. So, yeah, Sam does them, but he, he uses comments sold, and it's just way too expensive for mm -hmm. me. Um, I, I just couldn't, I, I can't justify the price. Um, I know um, Jill uses it too, Jill Wiseman. Um, but it just, I, I did I crunch the numbers. And I'm like, I can't. I don't mark my beads up enough to be able to absorb that uh, because it's American dollars, which means whatever they charge, I have to add another 40% on. And it was just, yeah. too, it's too much. So, um, yeah, yeah. And then if we were to add like a 20 coupon yeah i'd be giving like this getting... stuff away and then <laughs> shipping is just ridiculous right now so because i only charge 7.99 but when we're ma mailing out beads i often it'll be like 19.99 mm -hmm. so i have to absorb the cost of the shipping 
And um, I'll have to see what Kay does then. Yeah. So I'm going to watch, a I'll maybe I'll get you to watch a couple and mm -hmm. I'll watch a couple and we'll kind of figure out what works best. So if anybody has a really great idea, please send us an email at customer service at Kelly's uh, beadboutique.com. Savannah's just going to pop up the, um, the ticker tape right now, um, or the, whatever you call it, the thing. Um, so if you have um, an idea, um, yeah, I've watched Garrett lots of times, but I haven't paid attention to what he's doing. Um, I should go back through him. Yeah, I mean, I could talk to him. They're friends of mine. Actually, I, Linda yeah. just had surgery today, and she's doing well, which is good. So I was worried about her. Um, but anyway, I will um, look at all the different things. But if somebody really knows of maybe even an inexpensive program, something that we can use, mm -hmm. um, send us an email and so that we can. Because I, I tried Googling some things, but there really wasn't much information in there. So... Um, where you bid and at the end of the vendor has listings and their website with your name on it. You click, it. oh, um, Laura, if you could send me an email with that information, maybe of a couple vendors that you've used, that would be helpful so that I can maybe go back and look at some other things. That would be great. I appreciate that. I know there's a lot of people that know how to do um, much more tech savvy things than I know how to do. So there you go. So that's another week. That was a lot today. <clears throat> that was so, a lot of talking today. That was a lot of talking. My throat's <laughs> getting kind of uh sore oh what's not see that i knew there was another one um but there's there's just so many things so mm -hmm. we will be back next week with um i don't know what we're gonna do next week because i don't have any more well yes, i thought do. i do have some we beads. Have the good stuff the good stuff oh mm. do you know what i'm talking about no can i say it yeah you what all your check glass yeah but that was the stuff i was talking about today that i might but some of it you have lots yeah i have to we have we do have some check glass coming or yeah next week so <laughs> maybe next week will be a little bit of beads and maybe some projects so um yeah anyway so thanks for joining us um always appreciate it and um if you like this uh live or anything please make sure to give it a thumbs up leave comments follow us subscribe do all the things please it really does help us and um we really appreciate it i'm just gonna so. um answer a question quickly on instagram um, four to six blessed. If you go on Kelly's bead boutique.com and you sign up for the emails, we will be sending out emails regarding yeah any types of sales that we do. Uh, typically one or two emails a week. We don't try and bombard you. Yeah. We usually send out something on a Wednesday and then something on like a Friday or Saturday as like a little mm -hmm. reminder. Um, we didn't have one this week, but Savannah will put one together all about the bead buffet so that you can um, participate in that. And so, yeah, I just saw somebody um, mention that uh, if you celebrate Easter, uh, this is Easter weekend. So everybody have a, a really lovely Easter with your family. We don't have much going on. I, my mom's in Europe and my daughter and her husband, all the grandbabies are away and you guys are going to your mom and dad's and uh, I'm picking my mom up from the airport on, on Easter. So there's not a lot going on at, at our house for Easter this year, but we're going to try and spend some time in the garden because apparently it's going to stop raining. It's going to be so nice. It's going up to like 20 and yeah. it's full sun. And I'm so excited. Yeah, because it's pouring rain today mm -hmm. and it's cold and it's yucky here. So, all right. So everybody have a, a lovely weekend and happy Easter to those that celebrate. And uh, we will see you again here next Wednesday. All right. So go off and make some fabulous jewelry and we will see you all soon. Bye-bye. Right. Bye now.